So now we want to do some exercises as usual. And the exercise will make you to understand what you need to understand, what you need to know when we are talking of reflexive verbs. So number one, there is a question here and the, or the instruction, again, Z, again, Z, fill in this gap, just fill it in. And what are you going to use to fill it in? You use reflexive pronouns. So get it done now before we do it together. So now we do it together. Here we have the verb sich umziehen. Sich umziehen. And we have wir. Remember, this is very important, personal pronoun. Wir ziehen. Ta, 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 um. Just go to the table. You come here. Wir is here. And then you go to the accusative. Wir ziehen uns um. Well, for your information, all the verbs here, they are accusative, they control accusative, so no problem. Number two, ich bedanke ta 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 für das Geschenk. Ich bedanke, accusative, mich. Ich bedanke mich für das Geschenk. And then the next one, die Junge heget. Ta, ta, ta. And the verb is sich hegen. Of course, the verb here is sich bedanken. Sich bedanken. And then number three, die Junge heget. And then you see die Junge. This is third person singular. Die is here. Die Junge heget sich. Die Junge heget sich. Yeah? The young man is hungry. Hungry. Heget sich. Yeah? The Junge Heget sich, of course. The young guy is boiling inside him within. The Junge Heget sich. And then the last one, wir schämen. Ta ta ta, für unser Verhalten. The verb is sich schämen. Sich schämen, to be ashamed of oneself. Sich schämen, to be ashamed of oneself. So, wir schämen, and look at wir. Under accusative, wir, we are shaming uns. We are ashamed of ourselves. We are, we are ashamed of ourselves for our conduct. We are shaming uns für unser Verhalten. Okay, so I go through it again. And now you see, I don't know how many you have gotten this. One, two, three, four. If you get three, very good. If you get four, Oh, a four agent. If you get one, okay, the free agent. Yeah, you tried. Okay, if you didn't get anything, watch the video again and get everything. And after watching the video, if you still have questions, don't hesitate to contact me so that I can give you the explanation that is still needed to get you through. So, but then normally, uh, when you do something like this and you don't get it, two or three things to be done. Number one, Watch the video again. Number two, consult with your dictionary. Number three, now consult with your teacher so that you can get more explanation. So with that, we come to the end of the reflexive verbs. I want you to practice as many uh, reflexive verbs as possible. And the more you practice, the more you get to know. In your handout, you see a lot of exercises there. Get them and do them. And then check the answer at the back of the material that you are having and with that, you are there. Okay, let's take a Our videos in Symbiums by Nesten video. Ciao.